Hello guys, this is Dr. Lior Barl, and today we're going to be doing an awesome review about something that I've tried and absolutely love, another Nintendo Switch case. That's right, all the Switch cases that I've done a review on, this baby tops them all, literally, and I will explain everything, exactly why, so let's get right into it. Okay guys, so this is what it is, ladies and gentle germs. It's by a company called Spieltech. Spieltech or Spieltech. Uh, believe it or not, I was actually wowed by this because I never heard of this company. Uh, so somebody actually told me about it and I was completely blown away. I went on their site and guys, you know how much I spent on this? You remember this, the DX Racer? Okay, they make gaming chairs. I couldn't believe it. For like a hundred bucks, two hundred, three hundred, and it looks even more comfortable than this one. Uh, it has like, uh, you know, you'll see it on their website, like these cushions and all that, and they're like a fraction of a price. It was like a hundred, two hundred, three hundred, or four hundred dollars for, I think it was called Executive or something. So this company has been around and it's really, really awesome. But I didn't even know anything about it till I went ahead and got me this case. So you guys know I did a lot of case reviews for y'all. I showed you guys exactly uh, what each one has, their strengths, their weaknesses. And now I'm gonna show you this baby right here, okay? So just gonna show you from all around here. This is how it looks, just took it out. Okay, this is like, I can't believe it. This is a third party for Nintendo Switch and it's actually better than anything Nintendo has released. So guys, like I said, look at this baby right here. Comes over here. This thing right here, you're gonna see, okay? Right over here, I opened it already, pre-opened it. Uh, so it has uh, these tabs here that you could get it custom, you know, uh, different uh, custom, uh, different colors uh, to match your Nintendo Switch. For me, I just love the great controller icons and wanted to keep it as black as possible. I just love that stealthy look. Now check this out, I do love how you could see there's a bump over here and over here and you can see it now I'm gonna show you I'm gonna put the Nintendo switch right in there as well so we're gonna now open this baby up okay so you're gonna see okay a nice clam shell okay a little bit of a you see like a, a rise here and it all feels very soft like velvet uh, and right here also feels very velvety this is actually a stand as in the other Ni by Nintendo switch you'll see all the Nintendo switch uh, by Ni uh, sorry, the Nintendo cases they all have the same kind of uh, setup where you have this kind of stand except none of them have this mesh if you guys saw all the ones that I reviewed for y'all none of them had even close to this mesh now check this out one two three four five six times two is what 12 right we're not done yet 12. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Okay, 18. What's 18 times 2? 36. So we got 36. But what did I tell you guys about these elastic bands before when I did the 3DS case from some uh, unknown company that I, I told you guys before was on eBay that I found it? Uh, what did I tell you about these elastic cases? Well, let's see. Well, we put one game in here, right? And this is why I said 36, okay? We put one game in here. And now you take this, you make it facing the opposite way of this, okay? So you're going to have it like that. And now look what happens here. Let me just... Oh, sorry. Need two hands for this sucker. Here we go. two games and one storage so that's 36 all together because that's what I, that, that's what I just did 18 times 2 right because you could put two games in this now can you imagine 36 games in a case unfreaking real okay now this is a more practical case than you're going to get anywhere nothing is going to even come close to the amount of games you could carry over here and these that came with the nintendo uh switch i'm oh, sorry nintendo's uh you know nintendo's cases for the nintendo switch they came with two of these babies that only hold four games in each little card so you have eight together but if you have memory cards or whatnot they had these little where's this thing 
This is my other one here, and you can see why I needed to get so many of these. I think I, I tossed them. Well, anyways, they came with a smaller... See, these little tiny ones here. That already takes a, a game slot. And you could put two of the memory cards in here. But if you're a collector like me and you have a lot of games and you want to just take them all with you on a trip somewhere, you're going to want something like this. Because you could easily, easily fit so many games into this and take it on the road with you. Here we go. Here's another, uh, here's another uh, two more games just uh, to show you side by side here. So look at this. Absolutely stunning. I got four games right here. I got much more games. Obviously, you guys know me. The whole channel is about reviewing games. So I got a ton of games on this that are going to go into this baby right here. Now, they have a stand just like everybody else does with these beautiful straps. And you could hold it back with this one right here, as you can see. And now, look, you could just sort of like kind of position it. And boom, you have your... You know, you have that thing as a as a stand for the Nintendo Switch. This is nothing new to us because, you know, they all have it in uh, all the cases pretty much that are out there for the Nintendo Switch. It's like that. And obviously because they know that if it's not implemented, nobody's going to care about that. Now, for a lot of you guys that are wondering, does this case fit? Okay, does it fit? And, I, and like I said before, over here you put the uh, adapter and all the wires and all that stuff. Does it fit with a battery pack? Well, guys, you know, this is the most bulky battery pack you guys remember i did the review for the other battery pack that's even more uh will extend the life even more than this one but the reason i chose this one right now is because this is the bulkiest battery grip that was out this is the beginning when it first came out okay so look at this i'm putting it in right here okay does it work does it work does it work <laughs> yes it does and there's room okay tons of room look at this baby Unfreaking real 36 games to take with you on the go okay i mean where are you gonna get this and like i told you this company apparently makes chairs too does a lot of cool stuff for gaming you guys gotta check them out uh i was actually in shock and like and like i said right now uh you know the nintendo switch cases are going for what like about 15 to 20 some of them even 25 dollars uh you got no namer uh, companies like the ones i did before review for you guys uh, which don't even compare to this. Uh, they have uh, they have it for about uh, what is it like about sixteen to twenty two dollars. This thing is fifteen dollars, fifteen one five. And right now, like I told you guys before, when I walked uh, into B and H last time, when I was uh, happened to walk around in Manhattan, and I saw a big sale for the Nintendo Switch they had for the memory cards for the one terabyte uh, cards. And you guys remember the second we made that announcement, it was like everybody started buying them it went on back order because it completely flew off the shelves so right now i'm kind of scared to tell you this but, but i want to tell you because like i always do i tell you guys uh you know the the sales that happen but i'm scared that it's going to be too late and it'll be on back order so i'm just going to tell you straight up this thing is 15 dollars, but right now it's 10 dollars in, in that place called bnh so bnh photo video it's like bnh.com you can purchase it online i go you know i walk there right now because of all the stuff that's going on obviously i ordered it online this is absolutely insane okay and i can't tell you how strong this is how awesome this is how i don't know like this nintendo you gotta learn from these people here you got to learn from these people. This is how you do it. This is how you do it. Unbelievable. I just can't believe uh, uh, the amount of stuff that you could store into this little thing and take it with you on the go. Absolutely stunning. Anyways, what do I rate this? Very simple. You guys know I don't give a 10 out of 10 to anything almost. But the things that truly deserve it and for things that do what it's, you know, what it's meant to do, I usually give it a 10 out of 10 if I don't see anything wrong with it, but I give cr constructive criticism. In this case, there's nothing to give in terms of constructive criticism because it has everything you can ask for in a case. First off, the way it looks, okay? Absolutely stunning with these little tags here. Absolutely stunning. The fact that it could store 36 games, absolutely stunning. The fact that it has a mesh in here okay it's meshy as uh, i can't i don't know how to explain this but it's like a velvety feel to it that means it's not going to harm your screen which is awesome it's like they literally 
planned this out. The developers planned it out and said, this is what we want. Let's give them the best of the best. And that's exactly what they did here. I mean, everything, even here, it feels soft. So anything you store here will also have that velvety feeling. So if anything is, you know, needs protection or whatnot, that's going to help it. Right here, 36 games this baby can store. Un freaking real. I cannot believe my, my eyes. I can't believe how this thing can hold 36 games and how much stuff it can hold before you lock it up. Okay, so you you know you want to take something on the go, you want to take it, boom. You you know uh, all your all your games, all your stuff. You don't even have to you know, like in this one, I had to pick my eight top games in order to have it you know in order to have it for me uh, to uh, you know to take it on the go. So when I went to Texas, if you guys remember, I, I uh, you know I was there for about two weeks. I was a long you know there for a long time. I took my regular Nintendo Switch case. I would have killed to have one of these. To be able to bring 36, because all I did was carry these little stupid things. And I only had two at the time, so I only brought eight with me. So I couldn't even bring these little suckers, because I got those later. Yeah, because this is the Zelda edition that I did. So I would have killed to be able to carry 36 games, carry my battery pack, carry everything, throw it in my bag, because I don't have to worry. This thing is, is really hard clamshell. Like, you really, you got to feel this thing. This is really, really strong stuff. And it it's able to carry that much stuff. I could have just took it with me because I was bored to tears. I was in the Airbnb. All we had is a television. I was bored literally to tears. I would have loved to play my games and to switch it over to other games and other games and all that good stuff. But un unfortunately, all I had was like eight games with me. I, and, you know, I had to pick, you know, you had to play which one you're, you know, you have to see which one you're going to pick. In this situation, there is no compromise. Like I said, it's like the developer literally said, I'm going to, you know, let me give them this. Let me give them that. All the developers, I'm sure, came uh, were thinking about this exactly what, what other cases don't have. This is why I give it a whopping 10 out of 10. There is nothing wrong with this case. No criticism to give because literally every corners they covered. Unfreaking real unbelievable guys just incredible um and like i said they have a sale right now for what it says here 9.99 uh, i'm not sure how long this is gonna last because last time you know a lot of you guys contacted me and you told me you know every once we made the video everybody started buying them and then it went into back order uh and then you guys had to wait and you know some of you guys didn't get the sale and then i told you when they had the second wave and you guys purchased it then so that was uh pretty cool that they that they actually had sales even again and again so be sure to always look in that bnh site uh you know they always uh tend to have uh sales on the memory cards and stuff like that but in this situation the way the world works uh right now i had to do it online and i was really happy i took advantage of this deal for that little for that cheap of a price for 10 bucks you can't go wrong and even for 15 hell this is worth 20 hell this is worth 30 dollars i'm not even kidding because the other ones you're gonna buy for the nintendo switch can't even do anything this thing this thing does for protection and for travel not even a bit they perfected it third party ladies and gentlemen spieltech uh spieltech spieltech i don't know um really cool awesome company we'll look into more of their stuff i couldn't believe they're doing gaming chairs unbelievable how much money i spent on this poop right here and you guys know i love this chair i did a review and told you about this but i can't believe they have it now for like 100 200 300 400 i think they even have it on that bnh site as well uh let me just take a look really quick here so i could just uh let you guys know yeah they got a chair uh it's a hundred series gaming chair and look at that. All of their chairs are like back ordered because everyone is buying the hell out of them because who's going to spend this much money? I don't even know what I was thinking. I just needed something because my back was killing me. You guys remember my, I, like I said, I worked three jobs to make this happen. I was working like a dog and my back was killing me. And, uh, you know, they're coming out. They have $119.99. Wow. Okay. So I think most of their chairs are like about 100 There's a $200 one that's an XL. Uh, again, just like this, it depends on the size that you guys want. They even have the same color scheme that, uh, yeah, the Admiral is the same color scheme, ver uh, scheme version two, and it's 250 bucks. Literally the same exact chair. And they even have like these professional looking chairs, which is so cool. This is like amazing. Let me see. Uh, oh, they have even a green one. I think I'm going to, if this thing dies, I'm definitely getting the green. You guys know Vortex Cinema is green and black. That's my, that's my colors right there. Uh, and they have it for $200. It says currently not available. So I'm hoping one day they, uh, uh, th these are selling out then like hotcakes. Um, and that was uh, $200. I mean, just incredible. 
And like I said, they have like a whole line of stuff. So they probably even have even more things. I got to investigate this company, look more into it. But absolutely stunning. And they come with, let me see this. I know this one, the chairs here, just so if you guys want, come with a two-year warranty. And they're like a no-nonsense warranty machine. Like it's just unbelievably incredible. And uh, let me look over here. Just want to see um, how much warranty this baby comes with. Uh, this one right here. Just gonna check really quick for y'all. One over here, unbelievable. One year warranty on this baby. So, you know, standard one year warranty, but like I said, their warranty is amazing. I mean, can't beat this, y'all. Cannot beat this. So, 10 bucks. If you got, oh, <laughs> look at that. I just dropped it, literally dropped it, and I don't even have to worry. So, epic fail, maybe not. Maybe it's gonna make a point. Let me know if you guys are getting it. Let me know if you guys got it already let me know if uh if when you guys get it i want to hear what you guys think as always this is a self-funded channel this is the people's channel you guys know that's the reason i opened this because i'm sick and tired of those paid for reviewers that tell you something's good when it's not when they get paid to tell you things this is right here everything is bought with our money that's what it is and we do reviews on this channel and it's by the people for the people you guys know that i know that we all give back to the community together by you guys commenting down below let us know your experience i want to know you can validate what i'm saying you can say you don't agree with me we want to hear it down uh, you know down below in the forum section what you know they call comment section and uh let's help you know grow together this community and help people make better informed decisions to all you guys that wanted me uh you know the one to give me funding and uh, do uh, the Patreon services and all that. I'd rather you guys save up that money. Like I told you, I worked three jobs to make this happen. I got this, okay? The only way, and I'd rather you guys save that money, especially right now. Give it to charity. Give it to your families. Buy the tech that we do reviews on, okay? Buy the tech uh, that we do reviews on with that money. Give it to charity. Just have a good time. And, and this is the reason why I opened this channel. And the only way you guys can give back is by commenting. Comment down below because this is our channel, so that's how we give back. We help people make better informed decisions and sift through all the paid for, you know, crap that's out there uh, to make better informed decisions. That's really all there is. Now, so like, subscribe, hit that bell button, and definitely share. As you guys know, most uh, a lot of you guys who hit the bell button, for some reason, were telling me, you know, you weren't getting alerted of the new videos that were out. I don't know what's going on. You guys contacted YouTube. They told you because we're not big enough. Okay, it's fine. We're growing slowly but surely. We're not doing any advertising. We only took this channel serious, what, for like less than two years. So <laughs> so right now, it's go you know, we're going fine. We're growing slowly but surely. The family is growing, and we're giving back to the community. That's the best thing we could do. Love you guys. Thank you again uh, for joining me on this uh, thing, and uh, let me know your experience with this baby. Like, subscribe, hit that bell button, and share. Have a good one, y'all. Take care. Bye. As always, guys, if you like what you see, self-funded here, be sure to check out all my other uh, stuff from mini-series to unboxings to technology, you know, and uh, Nintendo reviews and 3D printer uh, reviews and all that good stuff. If you like what you see, the only way you can help the channel is by liking uh, this video, subscribing, and hitting that bell button. As many more cool videos to come, definitely want you guys in it, and I want, it, I want you guys to be vocal. Definitely comment down below. I want to hear what you guys have to say. Have a good one, y'all. Take care. Bye.